Captains, how's it going my fellow aviators? Now many of you will know that the 777 does not have winglets unlike many other aircraft. Now winglets are featured on many aircraft to decrease the size of vertexes at the tip of the wing. Now there are downsides to winglets. Firstly, they're prone to flutter. Flutter looks something like this and it's not safe for the aircraft to sustain this for a long period of time. It occurs as the aircraft approaches its maximum speed and it's not comfortable for the passengers either. Most aircraft using wingtips today actually weren't delivered with wingtips. There were actually solutions to improve aircraft fuel efficiency as a result of newly acquired knowledge of aerodynamics. Most modern aircraft like the A350 and the 787 don't have winglets, they have raked wingtips, which on some aircraft are more efficient than wingtips. The wingtip is blended into the wing, as you can see on these photos, and this is what is featured on the 777. Now according to Boeing, each wing on the 777-300ER is being extended by 6.5 feet, and raked wingtips are being added to improve the overall aerodynamic efficiency. The raked wingtips help reduce takeoff fuel length, increase the climb performance, and also reduce the fuel burn. Now winglets can't work on many long-haul aircraft. The wingspan of the plane has to be large enough to generate the lift required to let the heavy plane fly, however they have to fit into current airport gates. This is why the 777X will feature a folding wingtip. The raked wingtip does contribute some lift, whereas the wingless don't. Now wingless would require a larger wingspan in order to generate enough lift, but the plane wouldn't fit into current 777 gates. The raked wingtip does generate some lift, and also it reduces the drag, in turn improving the fuel efficiency. The wingspan however is far larger, that is why Boeing have decided to create the folded wingtip which will fold up vertically whilst on the ground so it can fit into the current 777 gates. Now captains, what do you think looks better? The 787 raked wingtips or the winglets on the 737 MAX or the A320 series retrofits? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Remember to, sub remember to subscribe if you enjoyed the video guys.